this the right way? Or it's just sometimes it's a little kind of Hey there, Duff here. We're at Ave Maria. You can see we have the Skydio. We have DJ. Hey, DJ. We got Katie. We got Cindy. We got Deb. Connect phone to Beacon. All right. No, oh, I recognize that sound. <laughs> okay, connecting the phone to the Beacon for max range. Syncing the GPS. Um, yeah, we're good. Sure. Mm hmm Yeah, heard about that. What's that? 28-year-old has it. Okay, we're taking off. Hold on. Is it missing? Oh, no, there's only two propellers. No, there's four. Okay. Okay, Scotty goes in the air. Have it set to follow me on a back left orientation. Let's see what happens here. I would kind of like if it was actually a little higher. I do have the uh, height ceiling turned on. Okay. Have my beacon. Don't be scared. It sees it. It is loud though, it's very loud. All right, we're gonna fly around trees. Wow, so some of the maneuvers this thing is pulling off to maintain front right position on me is crazy. Look at that, wow. Oh wait, I, I wanna get up on the sidewalk here. I can't believe what this thing is doing to, to keep me in camera. The trees and everything. It's insane. It's gonna have to, oh wow, it's gonna fly behind the fence. Wow. This thing's nuts. Oh, it's doing its thing. Yeah, only thing about the Skydio is it is loud. It is a loud drone, and that's why I would like to have it further away. Here's another alligator right here. We just, just seen two alligators. Yeah. It's an alligator kind of Sunday. All right, we're starting a droney. Cindy, yeah. there's three cows over there by the water. Oh, shoot. Okay. And in those little man-made ponds, there's a couple alligators. Yeah, we saw two alligators, too. Am I okay, though? Yeah. All right, I just fired off a droney. Let's see if it comes back. Okay, I think... Does it see me? Okay, I think it sees me. It's amazing. All right, with the tracking it's been doing, it's height floor reached, can't follow. Okay. It's coming. It, 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 no, it said that it won't go below eight feet, so it can't hit somebody. So it just beeped and told me that it, it couldn't, it couldn't follow. Okay, come on, bud. Now you're good. I don't think I even mentioned that I'm on the MSX. I'm on the MSX. This is just a casual ride. Test out the drone. Get some uh, time outside away from COVID-19. You know, I'm sure your town's like ours. Everything's shut down, basically. Although I do still be, I'll be reporting to work tomorrow, but um, school's shut down. Any sort of public gatherings are shut down. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. So as you can see, this is some challenging terrain here that we have the Scotty up, okay, just beep, can't follow, not enough room, all right. It's cool that the uh, beacon will let you know if it has a problem. I, I have the, the up and out, okay, figured it out, got to me. I have the um, height ceiling enabled, which doesn't allow the drone to go below eight feet, which would keep it from, you know, potentially hitting somebody or a vehicle or whatever. So that is turned on, that does, you do sacrifice uh, some maneuverability with that setting turned on, but uh, it's better than uh, 
unintentionally uh, impacting others. It is pretty amazing what it's doing here. It's crazy, but like I said, doing this kind of maneuvering chews up your battery. So I'm probably not even 15 minutes in and I'm gonna, I'm gonna head back to the parking lot to put this thing away because it's gonna run out of power. So I'll be investing in the second battery sometime, I'm sure. All right, so um, drones at like 25%, so I'm gonna haul ass back to the parking lot and see how it does keeping up with me. All right, it's 16% uh, battery and still aggressively tracking me. Look at that sucker go, man, look at it go. Whew. I mean, it'll just haul ass to, to get over obstacles to keep you in frame. It's amazing, amazing. All right, here we are at the LZ, back at the LZ. Okay, so we're gonna try to land this. Coming down, nice, nice spot to land right there. Success. Success. Nice job, Skydio 2. All right, so um, like I said, um, COVID-19, of course, is impacting our area just like anywhere else um, at work. They, uh, they are practicing social distancing where they encourage people to get no closer than um, three feet to each other and um, you know, don't shake hands, uh, limit physical contact sanitize, all that kind of fun stuff. So, you know, it's getting a little crazy. And, uh, you know, I always knew that this was gonna be a possibility, but it is kind of surprising how quickly it's, it's swept in. Now, now if, if you are having any kind of public event, you're looked upon as being like irresponsible, basically, if you uh, continue to do so. So, next few weeks are gonna be rather interesting. Saw some uh, cows over here that I was, well, I mentioned that, but I didn't want to scare them with the drones. So I just kind of rode by, but I want to go back and check them out. The girls were over here, but I'm not sure where they're at now, but I'll track them down quickly. Ah, damn, looks like the cows moved on. There's some, there's some sort of area back behind here where they have cattle and, and they just make their way through this incredibly thick brush sometimes just to hang out over here. It's kind of cool. So the cows took off? I only saw the one. Oh, there were three at one point. Oh, there were two and then one ran into the woods. Oh, okay. Are you go around me? I'll stay here. Okay, well at least it's not uh, sunny right now. Yeah, she says I can. I'm gonna get. I again, I don't know how that'll show up in the menu. He's a pretty good size too. Yeah. Gator right there. Hi, buddy. It's okay. It looks like a kind of a boring pond. And Deb's a gator fan. Well, I did go to UF. There you go. Do you want to try this? You haven't ridden the MSX yet. Oh. oh. You've never ridden an MSX before. Oh. Trade you. That's my newest one. DJ, what a big boy, standing up. Big boy, big boy. He's turning, strong legs. Whoa. Trishy. He's trying, he's like, look, I want to get up on my back legs, yep. Not in the mulch though. Not in the dirt. I want to eat it. Feels good, doesn't it? Mm-hmm, yep. Has a huge battery, so it'll go forever. That's my, uh, yeah, I'm selling those now. Oh, that's it's, your new it's a, thing. It's a bumper slash kickstand. Oh, it's a kickstand too. If you turn it off, it'll, it'll rotate forward and sit on that, yeah. 
DJ. Extreme riding coming up right now. Oh yeah. Extreme to the max. Still gotta get, still have to get the MS low. Oh boy. That's some hidden, uh, wow. Some real hidden ruts in here. <laughs> Oh my god, this grass is terrible here. Um, I still haven't gotten the MSX to uh, the swamp, obviously. Uh, when I do, you'll be the first to know. Yeah, that grass in that gully was terrible, man. Terrible. I was doing one of these uh, quite a few times. The gang. We got the DJ cam. DJ's in his PGV, personal grandma vehicle. <laughs> grandma powered. It's not bad when the sun's in. Hmm, looks like someone has some car problems. Yeah, it is, isn't it? <laughs> I guess when you don't have a garage, this, uh, this makes do. Oh, and it's from Arizona, weird. Has Arizona plates on it. That's very weird. I think we're going to be wrapping it up here shortly. It's, um, like I said, it's hellaciously hot for uh, middle of March. And, you know, with a baby and stuff, you don't want to push it too much. DJ got the fan. DJ got the fan. It sure is easier to do in an M10-3. Demonstration. That's how it works. Okay, we're packing up. It's been a hot one, but fun. Be interesting to see how the uh, Skydio footage uh, turns out. Let me know what you think about it. If you found this video interesting, please give it a big thumbs up. If this is your first time visiting the channel, please think about subscribing because only 13% of you watching this video are actually subscribers, believe it or not. So think about subscribing. Feel free to leave your comments, suggestions, ideas, and thoughts below. And uh, that's all we have for you for now. Until next time, Duffman and everybody else, out. Yeah, white is definitely helpful on days like today. Definitely. Ugh. Okay. I support that idea. <laughs>